Hello beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to On How channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. And you already know, if you have any questions, make sure to drop them below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you as well. Same as the over 100 videos I made now on Shopify customization. They were mostly requests from subscribers and some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. And I really appreciate it. And this video is actually a request again by subscribers. So this video, I will show you how to resize the product cards on your Shopify store. And we will do that without using any apps or anything like that by using our own code and you can customize the size however you want. Bigger, smaller, medium, tiny, anything you want. So it's your choice, no worries. And as I said, this is a request. So if you have any questions, any video requests, drop me a comment below. I will be happy to do a video for you because this channel is actually surviving by request. So more requests, more videos, no requests, no videos. That's really simple, right? And let's just go talking and let's just get to it and show you how to resize the product cards on your Shopify store. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard and I have here down team 15 version, which is the last one as if now, the time of making this video. And below here, I have every other free team, the most used ones. Uh, taste, sense, refresh, spotlight, and trade. And if you are wondering again, why is that? Because simply I do try the tricks on this as well. Not in the video, I mean. In the video, you will be bored and you will leave before we finish in the video and I will be the losing side. So no, I do this behind the scenes. In the video, I do demonstration on down because it's the most used one. But even if you use some of these teams in here, it will work for you just fine, no worries. Even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. So as I said, we will do demonstration on down team. But let me show you the cards so you can see them. Then we will do the trick and come back and see it in action. So this is the product cards right here. And if we want to resize these cards, there is no way on the team customizer you can do this. That option is not available. So you have to use the code. And that's why I'm here for, no worries. So we will keep this page open. We will get back, do the trick and see it in action. So let's just get back Shopify dashboard. Then we will simply click on the three dots on left of customize for the team we are using and click on edit code. It will take you to the code editor. Then click on the search bar at the top left corner. And again, either it will be base.css or team.css or style.css. One of these depends on the team. Mostly they use base, but if you cannot find base, find, oh, not that, not that, sorry. <laughs> so anyway, if you cannot find base, find style or team. So my, in my case, I know it's base. So I'm gonna click on base and here we go, base.css. After that, we need to scroll all the way down. Let me drag this down from the scroll by. By the way, if you are interested in how to remove the scroll bar from your Shopify store, check out my channel. I just made that video. So let's just scroll all the way down. Here we go. And we need a completely new line in here, nothing on it. If it doesn't exist, simply click front of the closing bracket, hit enter, here we go. Next, as always, scroll down the description box and you will see a link named it as cold and simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a very short cold as you can see. Uh, four lines to be exact if you want to count the bracket as a line and simply uh, select the whole code make sure to select the whole thing if you miss just this dot it will not work so right click and copy after that we will get back in here and paste it at the bottom of the page as you can see so let's just click on the save button and see if that will work or not so let's just get back and reload the page here we go it's much smaller now right if you want to make it more smaller or more bigger, simply increase or decrease the percentage front of width, as you can see. So mine is 60%, let's just make it more smaller, like 20% or just 30, 30%, which is half the size. So now it should get smaller more. So let's just reload the page. And here we go, as you can see. And that's how you resize the product cards on your Shopify store without using any apps or anything like that. And if you have any questions, make sure to drop them below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.